Hello everyone and welcome to the magical world of pyrography. My trustworthy linden plywood suddenly disappeared from the shop which I was using for the last two years. This is why I had to find an alternative. The easiest way for me was German Amazon, but the articles for sale there appeared to have big problems. Almost every kind of plywood I found on Amazon had the same strange description, naming several wood types. Have you ever seen any plywood which is linden, balsa, poplar and basswood at the same time? I have definitely never come across such phenomenon, but it looks like Amazon specializes on those unique supplies. But there were several comments under the items, complaining that they had got basswood instead of balsa, so I took my chances and purchased some to test. Looking at it now, I have no idea what kind of wood it is. What I can say for sure, that it is not linden. The color of grain is quite different, and it is also somewhat darker. But let's try to burn a beautiful picture on it anyway. You are watching Werewolfer Pyrography, I am Werewolfer. Your likes, comments and subscriptions can really help my channel. Let's go! I took a beautiful photo with two romantic wolves as a reference, which I had used many times for custom keychains and magnets. Let's see how it will work on a bigger scale. After burning outlines with my spear pen, I can definitely see the difference. On linden or poplar wood, I can get away with really low heat in the beginning, but I definitely had to use more heat for this wood even for the most subtle outlines. The same is true for my spoon pen as well, but thankfully I can burn well through the wood grain so that it does not interfere with the picture. I seem to have a bit of trouble with depicting fur. Somehow this wood does not allow me to burn very good details.
On the second thought, though, the lack of fine details might as well be caused by my laziness. To make the wools appear white or not so white wood, I make the background around them very dark. Looks like this wood gets so much steamed in the process of burning dark values that it slightly changes form. This has never happened before during my whole 10 year experience. Maybe it is really balsa, or maybe this particular sheet is too thin.
make the background more interesting, I burn the dark forest and the night sky. The night sky will need some stars. I paint them with white acrylics. And now the romantic woods are finished. I still have not figured out what kind of wood it is, but I can honestly say that I really like how this picture has turned out. If you have any ideas what it is, share it with me in the comments. Also, please, support me with your likes, subscribe, click the bell button not to miss my new videos, and I will see you next time in my new pyrography journey. Send you a lot of inspiration. Bye!